Okay, this is just a quick run through of the the pack, uh, the anatomy pack. It comes with um, a few different things. Um, one of them being um, a tail, a bone tail set with full animated morph. Um, it comes with four, I think, five horn sets as well. Um, the wings don't come with the anatomy pack. They they actually come with um, like a, a separate wing set altogether, which will suit for Genesis. 8 and Genesis 3 and the skeleton as well so there's the the five horn packs again both in 3D Delight and um, iRay there's a shot of the of the tail and it has some um, conforming eyes now I've got my own set of eyes there plus it um, has um, Genesis 3 and Genesis 8 eyes in there as well so whatever so whatever material um, <coughs> sets you've got for those eyes can be applied to these um, eyeballs and that's the comparison of the 3D light um, there's some of the easy pose dials here, just a quick easy views, S bends and um, length as well. Right, so now where you can find the anatomy pack, you'll find them under both. Um, the Genesis 8 one and the Genesis uh, the Midnight one there'll be a, an anatomy um, folder under it so um, in that uh, folder you'll see um, different ones this is the conforming eye so it's basically drag and drop <clears throat> now you you won't have any troubles with um, morphs interfering with the the eyes. I've already I've already taken care of that and zeroed out the morphs on the eyes. So whatever you need to have, it, it won't affect it. The horns, the horns are geographed, so um, it's just easy drag and drop, and um, as you can see, horns too. I've all uh, taken care of the the morph so they don't uh, mangle the um, the the horns when you're putting them on. So you're covered there, and it's just um, whoops. Yeah, you will have to have to um, delete the horns manually, but they're just drag and drop. I do have matching materials for the different um, skeleton materials, to m so they're compatible. Last one is Ram's Horns.
So all the horns uh, morphs have been taken care of, so you shouldn't have any distortion with them. Maybe a little bit on some of them, but that's but it's minimal. You say you no, don't need to worry about it. Uh, okay, so we'll just uh, we'll just leave one set on there for him. Next in the um, pack comes the the tail. Tail is um, drop and drag. It's it's a conforming, um, basically a conforming prop, really, with um, a lot of dials on it. So, and you can access the um, the dials for the horns basically on any part of the tail. You'll get these. So that's um, your side S bends. S bend up and down. Just an ordinary tail bend. You can go longer and shorter. The side bends. And um, twist as well. Not Twists are good for, say you've... Um, say you do a, a side bend, for instance. And then you apply your twist. That'll, that's where you'll notice the difference there. So that gives you a whole heap of options of different, different looks, different ways you can do things. So, um, and like I said, that um, all the materials on the tail that that'll be the same as the skeleton materials as well. So. Um, that's uh, the anatomy of pack. <coughs> the next um, one I'll do is the um, bone wing pack. Thanks.